Hey, how are you doing today? My name is Ricardo Cordu. I'm going to welcome you to day eight of the Walk With Me Challenge. And so you say, hey, Ricardo, what is the Walk With Me Challenge? What is that? Uh, basically, what it is, is I dedicated 21 days straight to walk at least 30 minutes a day. And then what I've been doing is I've been talking about success principles, things that I've learned over time, things I've learned from my mentor, and just, you know, just really wanting to pour into you uh, to allow you to be able to get some information uh, that'll help you spark yourself to your destiny. You know, that's my goal. And so let's go ahead and get started. So yesterday we talked about, you know, visualizing yourself winning, visualizing yourself accomplishing things, right? What does that look like? And so today I was thinking about, you know, some things that came to mind is consistency, uh, discipline, determination, being effective, you know, some things that I was thinking about today. And you ask, Ricardo, what, why does that matter for? And I'll just give you an example. So today, you know, day eight, I was thinking, I was at home. I was thinking to myself, I was like, I really don't have to walk today. Like, I really don't need to do this today. You know, but then I started thinking about, no, I need to. One, because this is a challenge. And I challenged myself for 21 days to do this. But also, I thought about you. I thought about, you know, hey, maybe this person today might hear something for the first time that will be the very thing that they need to hear to help them get to their next step in life. You know, sometimes we're always we're only one question away. We're only one word away from getting that clue that we needed to get us to our next step in life, to give us some direction, to give us some principles, some things that are going to just help us grow and do and be who we are called to be. And so what you can disguise your disciplines in, right, is you can make yourself accountable to others. See, if you can understand that you are not here just for yourself, but you're here to help others. The days that you might not feel like doing some things, the days you might not feel like you got the energy to do things. If you think about those people that you can help that you're touching, it makes you want to do it anyways. Now, what does that do for you, right? What does that do for you if you are in that position? To, consistency breaks resistance. Consistency brings diligence. It brings, um, it brings mental fortitude. It brings focus. It brings development. It, it grows your skill set. It... Uh, it, it builds your, 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 your longevity. You know, so these are some things that are very important for you to be able to be successful. Like, because all those things that I just named, that's what it's going to take for you to be able to even to, to connect the dots to where you need to go from point A to point B, to point B to point C, to point C to point D. You got to have those things in place. And it's going to bring confidence. It's going to bring character. You know, these are things are very important. It's going to bring integrity. It's going to bring honor. It's going to bring fulfillment. You know, these are all positive things that anybody you see who is really successful in doing things to inspire, empower others, that's what their skill sets are. And you see, it's like, wow. You should, you should say, if you, if you watch me for the last eight days, there's something that you, one thing I know you'll, you'll, you'll say, oh, well, he's consistent. Man, he's, he, he, he's talking some positive things, some positive messages. Man, you know, it's, he, he's making me think about some things, how I'm approaching life. Man, that I can be better, that I can do more. You know, you know why? Because that's how I think. And that's, I know that's my calling, to be able to give transformational information to spark people to their destiny. Because I know the definition of my purpose, right? And so once you realize that and figure that out, what happens is the consistency that you build, that you put out in this world, you'll be able to see the resemblance of yourself in all the things that you do. And so whether you're a part of an organization, you implement yourself in that organization, the organization will be affected by you. You'll create a pulse in that atmosphere. Um, you know... At some point, right, 
let's, let, let's just put it like this. At some point, I just want you to be happy. I want you to be successful. And like, it's, it's no, what's the, what are we living for if we're not here to, to put success in our lives? If, what are we even living for? Why are we even here if we're not going to just do the things that we need to do to go ahead and get the happiness that we deserve? You know, I, sometimes I'm, I, I lose sleep because I want people to succeed so bad. It keeps me up at night because you know why? Because I think about those things and I always think about, you know, is it something that I can do? Is it something that I can say uh, that would help that person, help you, you know, really receive what I'm saying so you can get to the next level in your life? Because you know why? I know, I know what it's like to feel stagnant. I know what it's feel like to fail. And, and um, it's not fun. It's not even, it's not that's not even fun, but it's, it's degrading, it's demoralizing. Um, I know depression, it, depression comes in them seasons. Um, stagnation builds depression. It, it, it will lead you to become a wandering generality and not to, and to lose hope, uh, to, to not have a helping hand, uh, to not have good relationships, to not end up being the mindset to want to keep learning and keep growing in life. Man, that's that's a sad day. And so, you know, I I I, comp I, 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 I plead with you tonight as you're watching this video. What's some things that you need to give up to go up? What's some things that you need to begin to start implementing in your life, either daily, weekly, or monthly, or yearly, that's going to allow you to really have the success that you desire, that it's going to lead you to the road that you, that call, I call the road call straight like Paul did. He was on the road call straight. What road, you need to get on the road call straight in life so that you can walk into your destiny. You know, the Bible says many are called, but few are chosen. Are you going to be the one that's going to really go on that road call straight today? Can you put some principles in your life? Can you build some principles in your life that's going to lead you to consistency, that's going to help you develop, to have you determined, to put some discipline in your life so that you can be successful, so that you can go through in anything that you might face and that you will be able to go through that situation at record-breaking time, that people will sit there and ask you questions all the time because they're like, wow, how did you overcome that? It's, it's no way that you knew that was going to happen. But you like you took it on, you overcame it, you went right through it. It didn't shake you. You emotionally, you emotional, your emotions stay, stay, stay similar, stay stagnant. Uh, your, your emotions weren't stagnant, but they kept going forward. They kept forward movement. It didn't pause you. It didn't, stop. It didn't make you slow down. I'm, I'm talking fast because when you know that you know that you're doing the things that you need to do in life, what you're called to do, it's nothing like you. And so my name is Ricardo Cordu, and I wish above all things that you prosper and be in good health, that your days are as sweet as honey, that your life bring you much joy and much laughter. Where life is love and love is life, we're on the winning side. I will see you tomorrow for day nine of the Walk With Me Challenge. We win when we all win. That's when we win, when we all win, right? So, you know, I'm speaking this into your life today, that this, the consistency that you've been missing out on, the development that you've been praying for and hoping for, today's the day that you get it, all right? Love y'all, bye-bye.